Draymond, he has a podcast, The Draymond Green Show. Go check it out. He recorded an episode of The Draymond Green Show right after them winning the championship. And Draymond, boy, boy Stephen A. and Kendrick Perkins, Draymond let y'all ass have it. Because what's in question is your basketball knowledge. Some of these asinine ass statements y'all be making, that's why I speak of the new media. For those of you that don't know what the new media is, let me explain to you what the new media is. The new media is not athletes doing media. We've been doing that. <clears throat> A lot of them turn into coons and start acting like the old media once they become media. But let me explain to you what the new media is. The new media is A, stand on your word. We don't apologize for our word. We don't flip and go. You stand on your word. Good, bad, or indifferent. We stand on that. B, we're not trying to create controversy. I'm not trying to align myself with a guy or two so I can fill some TV slots on a daily and create controversy. Basketball is a beautiful game. If you know the game of basketball, basketball will give you enough to talk about. The problem is all of these people talking about basketball that don't know basketball. And so what do you do? You chase controversy. The new media, we don't do that. That's why you see J.J. Reddick flourishing. That's why you see C.J. McCollum flourishing. That's why you see me flourishing. So we don't do that. We simply talk the game that we know and embrace it and teach. That's what these spots are about. How do you teach the game? How do you teach the fans the game? These people that think they know the game of basketball but don't really know. How does J.J. Reddick go up there and teach the game? That's the new media. We give flowers when flowers are due. We don't have to try to build a guy up for a week to tear him down next week so I got something to talk about. That's the new media. Respect. Integrity. Respect and integrity on the job, about the job. I remember days when you didn't go on a, on a TV show and cheer for another team. You go on and give analysis. Nobody give a damn who you cheering for. You got fools like Kendra Perkins come dressing like a clown. Come up here in a, a jail suit and then you lead a game early tonight. Stand on your word, brother. You got to stand on that. There's one thing's for certain. I'm going to stand on my full-time champ. I'm out. <laughs> Hey, same thing I say. And what he's talking about is that Kendrick Perkins was he used to play for the Boston Celtics, won an NBA championship with the Boston Celtics. And he, he picked the Boston Celtics to beat the Golden State Warriors in the NBA Finals. So Draymond was saying after he saw that Boston was going to lose, he left the game early. And Kendrick Perkins was on television cheering for his team, which if you're just still a player and they bring you on, okay, cool. But you're an NBA analyst now. You're supposed to be unbiased. So that's what Draymond was talking about. And Draymond talking about Kendrick Perkins trying to align himself with Stephen A. Smith to get more slots on TV, causing controversy, tearing people down. And that's what we be talking about on here, Cash? Oh, yeah. So that's what Draymond talking about. And the new media is like, he's saying the new media is like, nah, bro, we ain't going for that no more. Mm -mm. You say something about me, I say something about you. <laughs> you check me, I check you. You get sensitive, we get sensitive. Because right. that's the funny thing about it, Cass. They talk about athletes being sensitive. But these media people, especially Screaming A. Smith, they're extremely sensitive. Mm -hmm. Kendrick Perkins, eating chicken, calling me out. You got to be able to take it if you dish it out. But that boy, hey, that boy said some hearts. That boy said the Cooney tune. <laughs> oh, yeah, he, he, he lit him up. He lit him up. Hey, he wasn't wrong, so... No, just do better. The new media. Yeah. We the new media, man. Just do it. I'm like the old media, too, because I started in this in 98. Hey, man, but you, hey. I've man. always had a different voice, though. Yeah, but exactly. That's yeah. why it's, it's, you know, I, I ain't never tried to change my voice and talk like that. I never understood that anyway, man. When I when I watch the news, and I'm, I'm like, wait a minute. I know they're just not their real voice, man. No, they, have, they act. Because when you're in the news, they try to tell you not to have an accent. Have a Midwestern, uh, Midwestern neutral accent. 
like if you're from the South, you may drawl a little bit. You're from New York, you know, you talk like this in California, they don't complete their damn words. Right. Because that's what they're talking about. Mm. But anyway, hey, man, Draymond just wants y'all to do better. Do better. And I ain't mad at him because he has a, a platform, an avenue to check your ass. Mm-hmm. And he checked he checked y'all ass, bro. Do better. Me. He talking about Stephen A. Smith and Kendrick Perkins. He ain't called Stephen A. by name, but he damn so called Kendrick Perkins by name. Mm-hmm. Do better, man. But Kendrick Perkins is actually, when he's not with Stephen A. Smith, and actually giving some analysis and not being biased and takes his time to talk and don't get into the putting on costumes and all that, he a good dude. I mean, he's, he's decent. He still need to get better, but he's decent. I ain't going to say a good dude. I don't know. Do better, man. That's yeah, just do better. Just do better. 